Okay, hello dear friends. Today we work on the problem of the Im imaginary number i. So uh, I will just show you the problem number one i to the power of three is negative i. Okay, so before we do this problem, we will need to know i to the power of 0 is 1. Any number to the power of 0 is 1. i to the power of 1 is i. i to the power of 2 is i times i is negative 1. i to the power of 3 is i times i times i, negative 1 times i, so is negative i. i to the power of 4 is negative 1, uh, i times 4, i times i times i, negative 1 times negative 1 is 1. So after we know this rule, we can, we get to know that any uh, power that is the multiples of 4, then it comes to 1, okay? With this basic, we can do the first problem. Now we do uh, number 5 here. i to the power of 62. What do we say? No, we can see it like i to the power of 60 plus 2 i to the power of 60, 60 is 4 times 15. Okay, for this problem, I will write it i to the power of 4 times 15, right, plus 2. So, i to the power of 4 is 1, 15 times, f f uh, 15 times 1. A, a gazillion times of times one times one times one times one times one times one and you a gazillion time it's still one plus two so it's one times i to the power of two i to the power of two is negative one so is negative one okay this is taking too much time number nine i to the power of 0 is 1. We know it. Number 13, i to the power of, uh, of uh, <coughs> negative 2. What do we see? i to the power of negative 2 is equal to i to the power of 2. 1 over i to the power of 2. So you can do like this, 1 minus 1 equal negative 1. Okay, number 13, that is number another one. Number 13, i to the power of negative 38. We can see it, 1 over i to the power of 38. So, is i to the power of 36 plus 2 over 1. So, this bottom is negative 1, 1. So, negative 1. Number 14. Let's do i to the power of negative 54 equal i to the power of 54 equal 52 plus 2 and 52 is 13 times 4 so it's still negative 1 okay number oh, oh can you see it 10 oh Square root of negative 14 is 4i. C. 
Okay, now we need to do some rationalize. We know Z, this is now question 29, Z1 equal 2 plus 3i, Z2 equal Z2, 4 minus 5i. So we need to find A, Z1 plus Z2, B, Z1 minus Z2, C, Z8, 1 times Z2, D, Z1 divided by Z2. We do one at a time, okay? A, Z1 plus Z2 equal 2 plus 3i plus 4. 4 minus 5i equal combine the like item 6 minus 2i b z1 minus z2 equal 2 plus 3i minus 4 plus 5i equal negative 2 plus 8i c z z1 times z2 equal 2 plus 3i times 4 minus 5i equal 8 plus 12i minus 10i 3 times 5 is 15, i times i is negative 1, negative 1 and the negative is plus 15 equal 23 plus 2i d z1 divided by z2 equal 2 plus 3i 4 minus 5i so we need to rationalize it. So the bottom part should not have this i have a square root or something. We need to make this into uh, um, into uh, um, an integer number, uh, a complete number, uh, uh, not necessarily a real number, but it's a, 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 an integer. So times four plus five i over 5 uh, 4. So we are timing something that is not changing anything, but the point is to make this one rational now, rationalize the denominator. So it's 4 square minus 5i square, right? And on the Top part we have we haven't done it. Eight plus twelve i plus ten i uh, plus fifteen i square. Fifteen i square is minus fifteen, and this one is a four plus uh, four square plus uh, twenty five. So it's uh, 51 and 8, negative 15, so negative 7 plus 22i. Okay? I love you, I really do. Bye-bye. Run.